All right, you guys, so this is my workout today, um, this morning. This is me just doing Smith squats. I warmed up with a 25 on each side and a 35, so now I got a 45 on each side. And I got my hoodie on just because I want to stay warm. And um, I don't know, I just, I was kind of in that bodybuilder mindset. I just wanted to get a nice little, it helps to kind of vascularize, um, you know, the body and it makes more efficient and so forth. Um, but yeah, I'm going nice and slow. I want to focus on good form here. I like the added support with the Smith machine. Um, and look, the, the bottom line is squats are, are good movement when they're done with good form, but also it's, it's an anabolic movement. And I really like that aspect of it, you know. Um, it's a total body move, um, and it's just great for building muscle uh, indirectly. You, you're you're going to create a systemic response, growth hormone, testosterone. I just... I don't do them, you know, every week, but um, they're a great part of my training, and um, and yeah, I mean, you, you don't have to go heavy in here. I'm not going heavy. I'm just focusing on using good form and using an adequate load, and that was my objective this morning, and you'll see the rest of the workout as it unfolds, but so we're, we're going to move on to the next exercise. Now, look, guys, um, the angle isn't the greatest, but again, you have to understand, I don't have anyone following me around, and so, you know, I mean, and other people may not want to be on video, so. Here's me doing leg press. I'm doing partial reps, top range of motion only. Um, as you could see, you see those, those the, the pin, the holes at the bottom? Um, I've got it all the way back. So I'm kind of facilitating the, the, the lift here, and then slowly accentuating the negative. I had about 280 pounds on this. So, yeah, I'm just controlling it nice and slow in the negatives. I'm not doing high reps, probably just doing five or six. Um, so, yeah, it was, it was a good exercise. I had a good response from it. All right, so next, guys, here's me doing a T-row. I decided to put the hood on, guys. I don't know. I just felt like getting in that bodybuilder kind of mode and keeping the heat in my body. Um, as you'll notice later, I, t I, t I take the, the jacket off. But I, I kind of just want to get a nice little warm feeling and um, and so here we are just doing some nice supported T rows it's one of my favorite exercises and I rack it all right now here I'm doing a little bit of shoulders I'm doing a single arm side lateral and I wanted to hold my arm out to the side just because I wanted to create a little isometric uh, contraction with the with the non lifting arm just with the body weight of the arm I don't know it just felt felt right so I did it is me switching sides, line it up, get that arm up, nice and slow and controlled. Um, yeah, and just focusing on good form, slight bend in the elbow, coming up to shoulder high, fo focusing on the medial deltoid. Here's me doing Smith shoulder shrugs. I go a little wider here just because I want to work the, I don't know, I, I kind of like the, the V-taper aspect of it. I went narrower grip and then I decided to go wider grip. So nice and slow, get a nice shrug up, upper traps. Um, yeah, 45 on each side, just an adequate load. All right, guys, so um, here's my cardio. So I'm doing four-minute hiss, high-intensity steady state. And I will turn the camera to the bike so you can see exactly what my um, numbers are with what I'm doing here. But basically, I've got the level on 12 or 14, I think. And now I'm just kind of getting into the mindset of knowing it's 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 grind time so I'm gonna turn the camera pretty soon here this is the first minute uh, and I'm not gonna film the whole four minutes I'm just gonna highlight it so here I fade into the the, the back end of this second minute This is so, so good for the cardio. I just turn the resistance up. So as you can see, look at my heart rate. 175 average, 182 was the max. 19.8 is my average. This is the last 30 seconds of the four minute interval. Now I'm kind of finishing strong. I want to sprint it out. It's going to help bump up the average at the end. And you'll see my peak heart rate. It's ridiculous. It got up to like 194. I did this workout fasted this morning and I had a cup of coffee and some green tea. And uh, so 177 was my average, 194 was the max. All right, guys, so this is EPOC. What I'm doing here is MISS, Moderate Intensity Steady State. Look at that, level four. I'm showing you how it's not a lot of resistance. I'm just pedaling. 
But look at my heart rate. It's staying around 131, 135, okay? It wouldn't be this way if I was fresh. The reason why it's this way is because I did this right after that four minute bike interval. So now I'm riding the wave of the epoch. I'm just filming myself just so I can kind of give myself time to narrate this <laughs> as I talk to you. This is my first voiceover video and I think it's pretty cool. Um, hope you guys like it. But anyway, this, the workout's coming to an end. Um, again, guys, nothing crazy, just simple. Feel free to leave comments below. Thank you.